Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Danielle. Last video I reviewed Petula Active and I am doing another Petula Active review today. I have six items today that I will be reviewing. First for today, I will be reviewing the Mystique Shorts in Mystique White. And I have them right now on in Misty Green. So I reviewed the green shorts last time and now I have these. So I will show you the fabric, which is really beautiful. It is three different types of material all stitched together. They do have a front seam and it is a high rise short. And the inseam here is eight inches. And they have an extended crotch gusset to try and reduce any camel. They have a beautiful little logo on the back. So for these shorts, they say that they're more sweat proof than their green. The green shows a little more sweat apparently, which I haven't noticed because I'm not really a big sweater. But I know that um, the white, they say because it's light, if you're sweating, it's just going to turn a little bit darker white and there's already darker whites in here so it's not an issue and they are again squat proof and they're just super stretchy and comfortable not restricting they're not riding up they're just really all around quite nice And next, I have the Mystique Anne Freezer Back Sports Bra, and it's also in Mystique White. This is a size large, which I size into, so it was really exciting to get my hands on this. And I will say that the large fits really nice around my back compared to others, so I do really like that about this. Um, again, I'll show you the fabric. It's the same as the shorts. Beautiful. It's very stretchy, very smooth, not restrictive. They have their cute little logo on the back over here. And it's just a very regular racer back bra. I will say when I wear it, it feels so buttery soft. And I really love that about a bra because who wants to wear a bra that does not feel comfortable? So I like a nice buttery soft bra. I wish they had them in more colors, but not yet. the Ashley Inspire tank and it is in cool gray. I have a size medium. I'll put all my measurements and sizes of everything below so you'll see. It has this nice crisscross back here and it's open as well. So here it is up close. Nice little logo. It's really pretty. A nice neutral color you can match with a lot. So for this tank you can tie it up and wear it tied in the front, which is a cute little cropped look. And you also have the option to just wear it down and it gives you a nice little breeze in the back. And it's not like, ooh, I'm not wearing a shirt at all. <laughs> so you can still have a little coverage in the front, but have a nice little breeze in the back because when you're working out, obviously you're getting sweaty. So it's nice to have an open back. Next, we have the Shelby legging, which I did show you the Shelby in cashmere blue last time. This is the Shelby legging in basil. I got it because I loved the cashmere blue one, so basil. These are great because they have no front seam. I love that. So here is the fabric and color up close. Again, no front seam, extended crotch gusset. These accent lines on the side are beautiful and Right over here, we have their logo. And again, these are a 23 inch inseam. So these leggings are still pretty high rise. They come about like right around my belly button. 
They're just so buttery soft and smooth. They're really comfortable. They're very lightweight. They do not completely hide your sweat. You will show sweat if you're sweating a bunch. But again, you're working out, you're sweating, so that's totally fine. Okay, so next we have the Danielle Lux leggings. So you know, Danielle leggings had to get them. So this is them in large, I got. And it is their emerald pearl color, which is just like one of my favorite colors. I really like teals and stuff, so I was like, these are perfect. So these are their pretty much only leggings that they have that have a little logo on the back. So that's fun about these, a little unique thing about them. I do have these in the 26 inch inseam because I am on the taller side and I wanted them to be a little bit more full length and they are. Here is the fabric. It does have a front seam, but I don't really have camel issues with it. So it has the extended crotch gusset as well. And it's just really a great legging all around. Here's the logo. Right on the inside, you have the care instructions. So there are care instructions, if I did not already mention, on every single pair of the leggings and the shorts, the bra shirts, they all have it. So you take care of them and keep their longevity going. These leggings are also really buttery soft. They're really comfortable. Like I don't feel restricted in them. They do um, hold you in at the waist a little bit. So if you like a little waist compression, these are definitely better for that than the um, Shelby's. They're not as compressive on the waist, but I like that about the Shelby's. Okay, and lastly, I have the Kim Jogger. This is also a size large, and this is their stone color. It does have pockets, so you know I love pockets. I love this about them. They're really soft and comfy, but when you're wearing them, they don't feel like too loose, like you still feel cute in them, but not wearing like a full sweatpant. And the inseam on these are 29 inches. So they're long, so you can like kind of have them a little bit loose at the bottom, I'll show you. Here is the fabric up close. There is a front seam. Here's the pockets. They have the cute little logo. And it still has the extended crotch gusset. And right at the bottom, I'll show you up close, they have a little scrunch down here, which is the cute little jogger look that is usually on a jogger. Super cute, super comfy. And they have a different kind of tag inside with the care instructions. And I will say that these feel a little bit like the Shelby fabric. It's a little bit thicker, but it still has that nice soft feel to it. Really stretchy, not restricting at all. And these are also a higher waist. So if you've made it here and you liked what you saw and I was at all helpful, please like and subscribe. So I will also be coming back to you guys with some fitness videos soon enough. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, I have a lot of fitness things on there already that you can check out. And if there's any other brands that you guys would like to see a review of, please let me know in the comments below. And thanks for watching. See you next time.